All right, welcome back to Big Bird's Adventures. Yay, I know everybody's clapping and going crazy. I've got Big Bird's Adventures partner over here. <laughs> so we've been talking about healthy and first of the year. I think I got the water thing down just right. Drinking three, two liters a day. Stupid, but uh, we've kind of backed off that just a little bit, but um laura went grocery shopping today and we got the chicken we got the cucumber the broccoli and the carrots and what my goal is ours is we're going to food prep and so we're going to have food cooked and ready in the fridge and then stuff i can take to work and just put together in a microwave or not and uh you know start eating healthier so try to get away from the pizzas trying to get away from the the fast food which has really been difficult um i'm i'm here to admit i am a, i'm just i love fast food but here recently i haven't been feeling good I feel like my energy's down. I feel kind of slothy. And, uh, and you know, I don't want to go back to where I was. I want to go forward. That's what we're doing, going forward in life. So what we're going to do tonight is we're going to take a step and, you know, chopping up some cucumbers, broccoli, steaming some carrots, getting some chicken in, getting that protein in. I'm going to use my ninja ninja. So this has uh, been a Christmas gift sitting on the shelf for a year or so, uh, but it's pretty cool. We've made some hamburgers in here and uh, it's very easy to clean. I mean, these pans are amazing to clean. So like the lazy guy I am, I don't like cleaning stuff that takes forever, but man, this is amazing. And this cooks your stuff in like minutes. So. But we're going to get on to that. I'll bring you along and then uh, we'll we'll talk about what else we're going to do. So we're going to be doing all that tonight and then just kind of bring you with us and show you how it's done. But not really. Uh, I'm sure there's way better channels out there you can watch for healthiness and especially this fast fa fat face does not convince anybody that I'm eating healthy. Whatever. So, but my, my main goal here is to, you know... Can, I'm gonna not no, I'm gonna I have been exercising for the last year and a half I'll have to put a before picture up I'll have to put a before picture up while I'm talking <laughs> but he may not <laughs> I may not have enough room on this screen <laughs> <laughs> and uh, not to offend anybody out there all my PHAT FAT people I love you because I've been one for 41 years and I'm gonna say this out loud I'm tired of being a fat guy I'm tired of being the big guy I'm tired of walking around with an extra person on my back. You know what I'm saying? So it's time. It's time. 41 years old. Let's see what I can do with the rest of the 41 years since I'm sentenced to be here that long. And uh, we'll, we'll, get, we'll just start some planning and start some exercising and just seeing, uh, you know, what, what, what can I do, you know, to get rid of this, this face, which was a lot bigger. Um, <clears throat> I am going to take, take it slower. Um, I, I do have reps that I do. Um, I'll be doing some more walking and I'll bring you along on that. The channel is going to turn a little more into like how much weight. My goal weight this year is 100 pounds to lose. You either go big or you go back to the drive through You know what I'm saying? So, sorry people. Um, <clears throat> that's just the way it is. If you're offended, I don't know. There's plenty of fast food places that people are doing reviews on go check them out so um but if we do go out and we do eat out it's going to be very limited we're going to try to bring back that culture of eating out as special you know it's a treat it's a reward um yes me and laura do a lot so we could reward ourselves all the time you know what i mean but it's not healthy and we got to start thinking about our longevity um, thinking about our bodies, um, all these, you know, prescriptions that people take. And sometimes you can't help it because you got disease or genetic defect or whatever. But if it's caused by not eating healthy and eating out all the time and 
drinking tons of soda and all this stuff and I'm not judging. And a lot of people are probably saying that. I do these, I do these things. So to prevent me from being on prescriptions and in the hospital all the time and just getting a job for insurance, I'm going to try this out and I'll bring you along this year. Um, hopefully you watch. There we go. So I'm turning on grill mode. Um, if it cooks hamburgers in five minutes, Probably should do chicken at two. Um, that's kind of what the instrument. No, doing tickets at fit, chicken at 15 minutes. I got to shut the lid, but I got to put all this chicken on here. And what you didn't see off screen is I went and cleaned my hands and made sure they weren't disgusting. And only hopefully this fries up everything, bakes up everything pretty good. There is no frying here. It's not a fry daddy. But we kind of got to do this in stages because I have cubed chicken too. And see how they break apart there. And then we'll get the big, big chunkers. Big mother chunkers here. Boom, boom, boom. All right. And I think that's enough for right now. All right. Well, I pulled it up at eight minutes and you can see the chicken has turned completely white um, I'm gonna stick it in there for a few more minutes and I'm just going to season it with roasted garlic let's see how we do there I'm not a big seasoning guy but you know crowd says do it do it so shut it and let it go all right, we got the first batch out. Looks pretty good, and look, they just slid right off. So we're gonna bag these up in a minute, I'll show you how that's done. But we're gonna put the new ones on. I'm gonna just take these bigger guys here, throw them on. Oh, drop the seasoning, good job. Boom. And boom. So we're gonna throw those on there like that. We're gonna stab them. I know, all you professional cooks are like, what is going on? Who cares, this is my channel. Okay, Ooh, I hate greasy hands. And we're gonna take the garlic salt. All right, and then we're just gonna shut it. And I think um, right now it's on seven minutes and it's just, cause it is preheated already. And we'll come back when it's done. Well, we're back, I'm just gonna show you, you know, for your, for your cucumbers and such, the stuff that's not gonna get cooked. Just get you a Ziploc bag, shove them in there, kind of portion them out, so don't put all of them in one bag. Feel like we got four days to go and do four days of prep with what you have here so we are going to steam these guys and then throw them in the bags um, but and that way they're microwaveable when you get to them okay the breasts are done so let's get in here oh yeah you hear them sizzling and i got the flipper jacker dingers at her here i like to flip them over i'm gonna give them I don't know, three more minutes, but they're, they're getting pretty well done. So, I like it. Throw some seasoning on both sides. I actually was cutting up those little pieces over there, and I was like, that was a great idea. I'm glad I had that idea, huh, Laura? <laughs> For prep. This is the first time I'm excited. And really, you only have to do this once a week. You don't have to do this every day. I know some people don't like that. So you know just it's all about all the effort it takes to get in a drive through drive around wonder what kind of food you're going to eat you know what we're going to eat prep food maybe start uh-oh see i'm new to this grill come on why is it blinking at me oh let's go Let's go three minutes on this one. There we go. It's that easy. 
So I was worried about having to watch it, but so far, I haven't had to. So we'll see you when I get there. All right, well, um, looks like we did 12 minutes on the chicken. It's looking really good. Here it's sizzling. It's done. So we're gonna bag it up. All right, we're at a stage where <clears throat> the broccoli has been steamed. Oh my goodness. Should be here, you should smell this. And then we got a little bit of chicken over here left. So we're gonna take the broccoli out. Probably run the chicken for a couple more minutes or let it finish its cycle. And uh, try not to burn yourself. All right, so I got some additional things that you like to eat, you know, that are low carb, zero carb, zero sugar, those kind of things. Um, crab meat doesn't have a lot of nutritional value, but um, it's got 80 calories per serving. It's about a half a cup, so it's not bad. All right, so now we're, uh, <clears throat> I threw some more water in there, probably should have showed you. I put water in there, steamed up, getting the carrots, get you, get you a big old handful, <whistles> throw them in there, get you another, another handful, throw it in there, and then get the remnants, remnants, there's the broccoli, mm -hmm. and then just shut this puppy up, boom, you know, and then you gotta kind of stop it. I mean, it freaks out. Okay. Power up, grill up. Um, probably should move to air crisp on this one. The carrots got done steaming and they're. That's when you know they're good. Oh man. Oh. Mm hmm. Oh yeah. Mmm. That's a hot carrot, but good. Steaming them through the air fryer motion was the trick. So now we gotta cut them up, bag them, and we're almost done. All right, well, we're done using the Ninja and all good preppers would clean this out before they put it back up, get the kitchen all cleaned up. Uh, look at these. You got carrots, crab, broccoli, cucumber and your chicken and it's really important with your chicken to put a date on it any of your proteins um, the lobster meat's not really necessary but you know all the rest of this uh, you don't have to date but the definitely the meat so definitely the meat so there it is the uh, peach Australian family owned beverage from Wallabies. And we've had this in the fridge for a minute, but it's their nice little, their little bottle with this fancy tab that you pull. And we're gonna, we're gonna take a drink of it. Yeah. I guess you keep pulling. Oh yeah, it splurts everywhere. Great. Check it out. Check it out. All the way from Australia. These are bottled in Australia. Yeah, they are. 5% peach juice. So, here we go. Oh, yeah. All right, well, thanks for watching. And uh, subscribe, like, get your food prep on. You don't necessarily have to do the food that I'm doing, but, you know, find some healthy food, divvy it up. You know, make a plan not to eat out all the time. You know, so the rest of the week, let's see if I can do it and I'll report at the end of the week. But, um, you know, like I said, find your favorite foods, you know, for breakfast, eat some oatmeal, um, watch your portions, those kind of things. And then <clears throat> a lot of this doesn't have to be eaten all at the same time either. You can take the cucumbers, eat them for a little two hour snack, the carrots, the crab meat, and then for your lunch, just throw it in a, you know, a little disposable bowl um and heat it up in a microwave have a nice little lunch that doesn't require going out anywhere spending any money um you know drop some weight that kind of thing um and then uh what i'll also be doing is doing showing you my exercises that i've been doing um so i'm gonna start including that on the channel if you're interested uh, but um leave a comment 
Uh, if you have any suggestions, uh, be be gentle because I am a fat guy. So fat guys got feelings. So, uh, but thanks you all for watching um, and helping grow on the channel. And we'll see you again.